Hey guys, welcome back for another video. Today we are going to see how you can batch rename multiple files in Mac OS. Okay, let's say I have this rename demo folder created for this demo. Uh, I'll quickly show you what is there. So there are five files currently here. These are rich text files. As you might have noticed, there is a format to the name here, doc A, B, C, D, and E. Let's say you want to rename this file with document A, document B, document C, and document E. But if you are going to do it one at a time, it's going to take a lot of time. So I'll show you a trick where you can basically rename all these files in one go. So for that, what you will have to do is command A or select all the files basically. So command A will do the same thing. So you will select all the files. Now from here, you can either right click and choose rename or you can go to file and choose rename. So once you have done that, this is the rename window. Here you have, you'll have multiple options. Currently you will see that it is on replace text, right? There are three options available to you. You can add text, format and replace. So let's see what replace gives you. With replace, you can give it a name that is already present and what do you want to replace it with? So let's say for me, doc is already there and I want to convert or rename it to document. So once I click here, rename, all these files will be re renamed with document A, B, C, D and E. And here you will see that it is, it is also showing you an example, document A.rtf. So once I click rename, you'll see all the files are renamed. If you don't like it or if if you have made this in error, all you have to do is command Z that is going to take it back or undo it, everything. Or you can do control shift Z that will again redo things. So if you don't want to do that, you can go here in edit and do undo rename it will do the same thing let me show you the other trick now you have seen what replace text does let's see what add text will do to your documents so it will just add a text to your document so let's say i want to say this is rich document so this rich text will be added to all these file names so once i click here and you'll have an option to put it before or after name let's say i'm going with after name once i click rename you will see that doc A rich, B rich, C rich, D rich and E rich. So all of them are renamed. You don't like it, press command Z. It will undo the rename changes. And then let me show you the other option. So command A to select all the files, right click, rename and then format. So this is the most interesting one, which I also like. So in this one, it will show you the file format. Let's say I want to name it document and then I want to give it name and index. So it will start with name, it will also give it an index and I want to start with index one. So if I click rename, you'll see all my files are replaced with document one, two, three, four, five. You don't want to do that. Control Z, select rename. There, there are a bunch of options, name and counter. So let's see what counter does here. So once I click that, it will add like a counter. So nothing too fancy here and then let's see the last option so in the last option it will provide the name and date as well so once i click here it will add like a date after the document hope this video was useful to you if you learned something give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel for more such videos i'm going to put out a series of mac os tips which will be really useful in your day-to-day -day work so see you in the next one